See the phone, man. It ain't going nowhere. Got it plugged in. Go to the truck real quick. Egg and this little tater out doors locked. Forgot. There's been some dogs up here. They probably heard tater in there. Mom's dogs. This is mama. My mom and dad live right here. And Kevin and Derek and my sister Samantha all live right here. Hey Tater, come on, boy. You wanna get in? Come on. Come on, here you go. Let's get in. Let's drop down. There we go. Go use the bathroom right quick. Here we go. Squirt the dirt. There we go. Oh boy. I didn't shoot anything this morning. I seen a bunch though, Tater. I actually seen six this morning. Yeah, I showed y'all them four does. I didn't show that. I didn't film the other ones that I seen. I didn't shoot nothing. Man, we had a massive rain <laughs> last night during the night. Actually, two different rains during the night. This is uh, our gravel pit right here at Mom and Dad's. Gravel pit, clay pit. There's our 200 John Deere excavator. Right there. So I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna load, put Tater back in the box. We're gonna go to the house. I got a bunch of stuff to do today. I'm gonna put out fertilizer, fertilizer, all the uh, green fields with ammonia. And uh, I got a bunch of traps coming. Be delivered today. Leg hole traps for uh, bobcats and I got some smaller traps for a fox also too because I've got uh, I got some fox there at the house that uh, I need to do something with I've, I've had trouble with fox over the years there but yeah it's got a bunch of stuff to do today all right so I'm loaded up I'm gonna top my feeders off over here I've got a new chair for a shooting house I've got ammonia we're gonna juice these uh, green fields up over here get that done and uh and then we're gonna hunt this afternoon that's what we're gonna do so uh i'll film some of this i've got a uh i know i've got a raccoon over here in a trap over here we're gonna go over here and uh, get him real quick and i got a possum over there on the other side of the creek over there Then we got Mr. Possum. We gotta get him out of the trap right quick here. Let him go. Y'all ever seen a dog track a deer? You about to. I done put him on one I shot a while ago. He's got to, uh, he's got to sort it out first and he's gonna go. Let's go, Tater. See, I didn't even see that blood. He just found that blood right there. He, the, the dog is, uh, see, he's sorting it out right now is what he's doing. I didn't even see that blood until he came over here and got on it. You can see it right there under them leaves. He got to mark his territory right there. Got to drop some kids off at the pool right quick. All right. You done took your dump. Let's go find a deer. He gonna go now. All right, it's all over with now. All I gotta do is wait for him to get on it. Is all. I'm watching him here on my GPS and see where he goes. There. I'll know when he finds it. He may be on it now. Told y'all as soon as he got gone on it right here, he'd, he'd be on it. Go, go get on it there. I know you done seen it over there. Oh God. I see the blood on that tree right there. He's beside the deer. He treed on it. He left it though. 
why I did that for. This is the thickest stuff, good God. See the blood over there? See, there's a deer laying right there. See, taters on, right on top of the deer right there. And stuff, they're always going to run in the thickest stuff that they can possibly run into, too, man. Good grief. Hit the briars in here. See, see the blood right there before it went down. Oh, tater. Good boy. Good boy. Did his job. Good shot on it, too, man. Right there behind the they're behind the shoulder right there. Sweet. Better sit down. Fall out, boy. <laughs> I can hear him over here running. Well, Dad is. I know there was some, uh, I think Kevin ran for a little bit this morning. Maybe. I don't know. I'm gonna check Daddy's scales for him here right quick so I don't have to get up and down and stuff. This is scales right there. Glad to see him. You got 80,900 on. We can legally haul 84. Son of a gun's getting lazy in his old age. He ain't throw the cable over. He gonna set it over with the loader right there. I'll throw this one far real quick. Maybe you've seen that, I doubt it. I just want to show y'all what a deer will do to a cotton field. This this is ours right here. Look at they ate this whole end of this cotton field up right here. Oh deer's bad news, boy, on a farmer. It'll wear them out, man. They still gotta pick this cotton here. It's uh Ain't even touched this field yet. Cotton looks pretty good. For it to have as much rain as it's got on it. So look at what the deer did on this finger back here. This little pocket. They wore it out, boy. Walk over and cut the light on. So I've had the ranger a week last night i've got uh right at 40 miles on it already and like uh eight seven eight hours something like that on it i like it so far i really like it i got a uh, milwaukee sent some stuff today's course black friday they sent me some these are the uh head covers for the extended reach ratchets that they sent me which is one of these are right here so we go on it I, I really like the extended reach right there a lot better than the short one the short one's out of their place but uh i like the longer neck ones too a good bit better so i'm, gonna, I'm about to edit this video that i'm making right now I had several traps come in uh yesterday no not yesterday wednesday these are for uh coyotes and bobcats and these are for fox right here i'm gonna work on the five got fox right here at the house right here that uh, i've got one that's actually going on the drive up and down the driveway every night like clockwork so i'm gonna be able to practice on them right here but uh so that's what i'm gonna do so old tater old tater he's a fun little old dog that's the first deer that i've had him on this year and it's kind of funny because the dogs can can do things that the human being cannot and the biggest thing of which is smell scent and even though i shot that deer right the perfect shot the deer's willingness to live is just unreal and how far they can run even on a well-placed shot like that 
and then having to try to find blood or this or anything you know and the dog can just do it so much better than the human being can and so much faster too so it took him just a second to kind of refresh his memory on what was going on and uh away he went and then the rest is history so hope all y'all are enjoying your thanksgiving uh, holiday weekend here i know i am i have been hunting like crazy and we'll continue to hunt uh, back in my heyday i've always enjoyed hunting i've had a few years where i hadn't done it quite as much as i have in the past well like i used to some but uh, i've hunted every day this year this whole season so far except for one day i've missed one day but i enjoy it i enjoy being out there enjoy watching the deer seeing what i see and things like that I enjoy fooling with the cameras too and uh so i'm gonna go back again this this afternoon and try it again uh, so that's what i'm gonna be doing uh, you can uh see what else uh, i got something else on my mind hang on just a second i'm kind of talking about the trap and i have wore the uh coons and possums and stuff like that out big time i need to get that lead out of here out of the back of this thing right here i have wore them out this year i've got i've got traps here set at the house here too called a possum night before last here at the house and got him it's good to keep those predators down because man they'll start man I've, I've actually had possums up in my dead gum carport before and things are you know, nuts i've shot a, a fox from my carport right there one day killed it right there in the driveway and uh so those things man they get they get brave they get brave so i'm uh i'm gonna turn on here in just a second i do believe so y'all check out everything down below man there's a lot of stuff down there the website if you want some some cotton top three stuff had a bunch of orders come in over the holiday weekend i'll be shipping out monday getting them going and uh still doing pretty good on stock i got some things i don't have in certain sizes but uh doing pretty good so we shall catch y'all later later taters